Allen and his sausage talk. I mean, if you say to somebody, sausage, people know what it is. It's going to look like a little firework, isn't it? But uh, you get different, different sorts of sausages. Big sausages, small sausages, fat sausages, little thin sausages. You know, the fat ones are the best. You know, you get little fat sausages and sausages. And uh, I had them yesterday, actually, because I'd been and bought them in, in Marks and Spencers. And uh, they were little fat sausages, only about an inch. Quite enough, as far as I was concerned. So I stuck them in a frying pan, turned up full heat. They're already cooked, and you just whiz them around a little bit. And, uh, and then you just pop it in your mouth. You know, and that kind of, you know, that kind of works for people nowadays. People like that. I mean, now, now we've had it, I love them. Absolutely love them. But no, li little sausages. They come in all sorts of shapes and sizes. And they do a really enormous one. You know, if you go down to the, to the German sausage shop in London. They do a, a really huge sausage. I mean, to be honest, it's like 12 inches long. I mean, seriously. That's what you call a good sausage. Because if you like a, a sausage and it's only small, you know, then you get a bigger sausage. It lasts better. But I want to know what, why. When you get the sausages, which you get at the uh, Christmas markets and stuff like that, the roll that they put it in is half the size of the sausage. It hangs over each end. So you've got to eat each end of the blooming thing before you can actually get to the you know, why they just don't buy bigger rolls, I've got no idea. Nothing worse than having 12 inches just hanging over the end. The fat ones are the best. Pop it in your mouth.